So hello, 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 brothers and sisters. Welcome to Call to Conquer. Um, my name is Rhonda, and I pray you all are having a great day today. Um, so the title of this video is A Warning to the Followers of Jackie Hill Perry. Um, I had this dream from y'all on uh, October the 20th. And just a little backstory, brothers and sisters. So this isn't the first message that I've actually given to Jackie Hill Perry. Um, Y'all had me to actually give her a message on May of last year, and it's deleted on YouTube, but um, it's still on, uh, por a good portion of it is still on t uh, TikTok, my TikTok. And so in that particular message, uh, Y'all had me just um, telling Jackie Hill Perry that there should be, he wasn't pleased with the way she dresses and that there should be a, a difference between how a man and a woman uh, looks and he mentioned the spirit of confusion he also mentioned that he had me to use uh, an analogy with the three Hebrew boys brothers and sisters how when they were thrown into the fire um, and even after they came out of the fire brothers and sisters that they didn't even smell like smoke none of their clothes were burnt and he had me to tell her, like, when you've been, you've truly been delivered from a lifestyle, because she gives the testimony that she used to be in the colorful um, lifestyle, but God deliver her. Y'all deliver her. And he was saying how there are still remnants of her past life visible in her life. And he wasn't pleased with that, uh, brothers and sisters. She dresses just like a man. And y'all said that there should be a transformation if he truly has delivered you just like the three Hebrew boys were once in the fire and no one could smell smoke. He said that there should be the same thing with Jackie. Like the people looking should notice that, should not be able to tell, hey, you used to be a lesbian. And so he had me to tell her, uh, um, knew her husband, um, Perry, uh, uh, a Preston, you know, that he needed to wake up and come to him also. You know, um, what I'm noticing in the body of the body of Christ is a lot of the men are taking a back seat to their wives and it should not be that way, brothers and sisters. The man is the head. Um it's as if the you know wife has a a leading role in the marriage. And I don't know, like I, I stated in another vid video, and it could have been a video of my, my community post, like I'm noticing a lot of names, big time names in the body of Christ, like the women are pushing feminism, okay, are, are, are pushing the feminists, and those with eyes to see don't pick up on that, so, um, it's like, like I said, it's like the husband is taking a, a back, you know, a back seat while their wives are the leading. And that's not how that goes, brothers and sisters. There's order in the body of Christ, okay? Yah has order in his kingdom. So, I'm going to go ahead and read um, John the 10th chapter, St. John the 10th chapter, starting at the 11th verse. And it says, I am the good shepherd. The good sheep giveth his life for the sheep. But he that is a hireling and not the shepherd, whose own the sheep are not, seeth the wolf coming, and leaveth the sheep and fleeth. And the wolf catches them and scattereth the sheep. The hireling fleeth because he is a hireling and careth not for the sheep. I am the good shepherd and I know my sheep. And am known of mine, as the Father knoweth me, even so I know the Father, and I lay down my life for the sheep. Hallelujah. So this is the um this is what Yah brought to my mind immediately upon waking up from the dream about Jackie Hill Perry, brothers and sisters. And so as I mentioned, I had it on um October the 10th the 20th I'm sorry October 20th of this year and um I'm gonna read what I had uh down and I said I had a dream about Jackie Hill Perry I dreamt that I could see a storm was coming and people 
were in the distance. So there were three part, there were like three, um, ships, brothers and sisters. And, uh, the, the ship, like the, I was on one ship. Actually it was four. I'll say it was four, but I could, from the vantage viewpoint that y'all gave me, I saw, I could only see like a portion of the ship that was open. And so at the ship in the distance was the followers of Jackie Hill Perry and Jackie Hill Perry was on a, a totally different ship and she was preparing for to do a speaking engagement with um I guess her mentor and um her followers were waiting to hear from her and I was on a, a ship and and I saw a ship that was leading in the opposite direction to safety brothers and sisters now these ships were done up like a, a house or a buildings or something but I I knew that they were kind of yeah what, what y'all was trying to say and so underneath us obviously was water brothers and sisters but in the distance in the sky a storm was coming that was going to cause flooding and total destruction and in the dream jackie knew the storm was coming but because she was so hell-bent on getting money brothers and sisters from her speaking engagement she would not warn her followers she did not care brothers and sisters i know a lot of y'all are in idolatry with not only jackie but many um people in the body of christ that y'all go hard for but you need to come out of and you need to repent because a lot of these people do not care for your souls because just as i read they're hirelings they were not sent by yah they were not called and sent by yah hear what i'm saying and so many of you when you see these types of videos, granted, some people are not called to do this. They're just doing this just because their channel is monetized and to get money. My channel isn't monetized and I don't even have a big enough uh, following uh, if I did. But my channel will, will never be monetized. So you can cut that excuse off. Um, if, if I'm trying to use, you can't say that I'm trying to use her name to grow because this isn't my first time doing the message um, about Jackie. Okay, but instead, instead of seeing this as love, many of you, oh, it's so much division. Well, Christ said that he came to bring, a, he didn't came not to bring peace, but a sword. But because many of you don't read your scriptures, you read it just to, to get yourselves through, uh, 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 for, or uh, you listen to these motivational speakers instead of actually uh, allowing the Holy Spirit to open the eyes of your understanding to understand what you're reading. When we come and we we do stuff like this, that uh, y'all servants and messengers, y'all look at us like we're crazy and say we're trying to sow division. No, y'all want call us to expose. He said, "Open rebuke is better than secret love." You should be seeing this as love, because y'all said, "Whom I love, I chase, I chastise." Chastisement is a form of love for y'all, but because you're so earthly minded you're carnal minded and you goes with the world's definition of love the world's definition of love they say hey even though i see these people going off a cliff and going the wrong direction i'm going to side with them in their wrong y'all's love say if you see your brothers and sisters sinning sin not to death you should ask and give them life who do you ask yeah whom i love i chastise I chased him. He said, if I don't chastise you, you are a bastard. You don't belong to me. So this is a form of love. So back to the dream. A horrible, brothers and sisters, storm. I could see a horrible storm was coming. And Jackie's followers could not hear what I was saying to Jackie, but Jackie understood that a storm was coming. She did not want to warn because she wanted her pockets to be greased. I don't care what persona people put on for social media. Y'all know what's in a person's heart. And I, so I began to plead with Jackie. I said, Jackie, so you're not going to warn. Okay. This is what I have written down. I said, can't you see a storm coming? I said, think about the people that are under you that will get hurt. And I said, she, I, I, uh, 
put down. She paid me no mind. No mind. It was like she was more concerned with herself and her job than the lives of the people who looked up to her. I started trying to tell and warn the people, warn her followers, that a really bad storm was coming and they needed to get to safety. I could look and see the waters on the ground beginning to rise, brothers and sisters. The water was rising. Not only would the storm tear up everything in its path, this is what I put down, it would cause flooding too. Looking back, one thing that the Holy Spirit reminded me is that Yah was the land of storm for the sake of the people. Jackie was chill and had no sense of urgency. In fact, she was making food like nothing was happening. She did not care, brothers and sisters. Even in the dream, I could feel Yah's love for her followers because he was delaying. He was delaying what was happening. And I, brothers and sisters, you know who was willing to risk their life? Even though the storm was coming in. Me. Me. I could have, I, in a dream, I could have left and got on the boat to safety. But I was trying to plead with Jackie because her followers would not listen to me. And I was saying, Jackie, please do it for your followers. These people look up to you. She did not care, brothers and sisters. And so I'm telling you by the power of the Holy Ghost, those that are not only following her ministry, but other ministries that you know, true, true prophets and true uh, seers and true men and women of Yah has been speaking against, you're going to go down with these people. They care nothing for your soul. They care nothing for your relationship with y'all. They are liars and they are wolves in sheep's clothing. And just as Jackie went about her life, let me tell you something that was, that was even bad. The woman that she was under, the, her mentor, even started becoming, started becoming fearful and started to turn back. Brother, but Jackie was not concerned. It was as though nothing was going on. And these people know destruction is coming, brothers and sisters. They know it's coming. But because they don't, they they are serving another God. They don't care about Yeshua HaMashiach. They don't care about Yah, the most high, and his love for his people, even in the midst of your rebellion. So in the dream, y'all was delaying the storm. He saw me pleading. And I wouldn't leave. I wouldn't leave the people. So y'all got to repent. You have to repent for idolizing these people. You have to repent for seeing the signs and ignoring them. Y'all know that y'all has been tugging at many of your hearts to let these people go. Stop listening to their stuff. Stop following them and, and, and get in your word and study to show yourselves approved. Curse be the man that puts his trust in man. That's scripture. And when y'all judge them, y'all are going down with them. If you don't turn from your ways, he's giving you a chance right now to, 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 to walk away. I wouldn't delay it. God bless.